Actually, I'm a photographer. I took this job because I love people. I quit my job. I just can't take this anymore. So the basic problem is that I'm still around. That sharp knife we have. The Army can make you feel a lot of ways. Tired, challenged, trained. This doesn't look bad. What, the Army? You're kidding. You ever been uh, convicted of a felony or a misdemeanor? That's uh, robbery, rape, car theft, that sort of thing. Convicted? Yeah. No. Never convicted. It's good. It's good. I've always been kind of a pacifist. You're all in this together. One of these men may save your life one of these days, you understand that? Then again, maybe one of us won't. I want to thank you for making me join the Army. With a capital A, huh? You know what that means? Do you? That means that our forefathers were kicked out of every decent country in the world. Ah, all right. Hey, who are walking? Ah, we are the wretched refuge. This isn't what you think. No, we're just good friends. We're not on my roster. <laughs> That's just the way we like to keep it, Captain. Intelligence? Some. It's come to my attention that several members of the 3rd Platoon Bravo Company left this military post without permission. It's okay. Special assignment. Yeah, who was there? Louise, it's so nice to see you. What are you doing? We're underdogs. We're mutts. Here's proof. His nose is cold. Mom, I'm home. Where the hell have you been, soldier? Training, sir! Training, training sir! Up! What kind of training, son? Army training, sir! Chicks dig me. Because I rarely wear underwear. When I do, it's usually something unusual. We're going to be killed! Oh, no. Just keep your hands on the wheel and slow down! Not killed! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! One of these days, if a thing that I want is gonna be mine. But if it ain't, that'll be all right as long as there's sunshine and a big old roof.